Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So for this video, I'm going to be doing a huge try on haul. I'm pretty sure everything all together is worth more than $500. Um, the clothes are from mainly Shein and um, Romwe. And then I have some clothes from Fashion Nova as well. So before we get started, don't forget to subscribe, like, and turn on the bell so you get notified whenever I post. So, I'm going to tell you guys how many items I have of each before we start so you guys know how much I bought. Um, I have 14 bottoms, 9 bathing suits, 5 rompers or dresses, 21 tops, 1 sweater, and 5 jewelry pieces. So, um, some of the clothes, um, the last sheen package took very long to get here. It took like 3 weeks. So, I obviously needed to, like, show off the clothes a little bit. So, um, towards the end, I'll make it so that's all the way in the end. Um, the reviews are going to be through pictures, not through me trying it on in front of you because I had already worn them. So, yeah, all the rest of the clothes is going to be me trying it on and then giving my review. So, I'm going to, like, split the screen so that half the screen is the product and half the screen you guys see me, um wearing it so yeah let's get started i'll put it in like outfits i guess um i'm gonna start off with shirts and bottoms and then i'll go into bumpers and dresses then i'll do the bathing suits last um i'll put timestamps in the bottom if you guys want to fast forward to let's say bathing suits or dresses and rompers so yeah Let's start. The top is from Shein and the bottom is from Fashion Nova. Um, the top is a size small and the bottom is a size 7. So the top, I'm going to give it a 6 out of 10 because it is a little see-through. And I'll only be able to wear it if I have like a strapless bra, which I don't have at the moment. So yeah, it is really cute though. And this outfit actually all together would look really cute. Um, the pants, I'm giving a 10 out of 10. They are mom jeans, and my measurements, just to guys, give you guys a little perspective, my hips are 40 and my waist is 28. So they are obviously going to be a little big on the waist, but besides that, they're completely comfortable. They, I'm 4 foot 11, and they like go, it's so hard, they go like right there. Um, so they're like the perfect length and they literally fit me perfectly. I'm definitely going to be getting all my jeans from Fashion Nova. Now we have these jeans from Shein and this top from Shein. Um, the top is a small and the jeans are a medium. Um, they just like the little, little. Um, I'm going to rate both of these a 10 out of 10 because the top, the material, I don't, honestly, I think I think it's cotton. I would assume it's cotton, um, but it's literally not um, itchy or anything. It goes to like the perfect part of my stomach, and then the jeans they are perfect. They are stretchy. They're not jean material. They're more like stretchy material, if that makes sense. Um, but yeah, definitely ten out of ten. Ten out of ten. Um, and then this is how much they scrunch at the bottom, um, which is not a lot considering that their models and such are like. Five seven five eight. So I'd say this is really good. They are a little high waisted, and yeah, I give both of these ten out of ten. Ten out of ten. Here we have a top from Shein and shorts from Shein. Um, the top I'm gonna give an eight out of ten because it is very cute, and honestly, I think it looks a little orange in the picture. Um, it's like a neon orange in person, but it is very thin material and it is see through. So I'm giving the top. Uh, 8 out of 10, even though it's still cute, so I'm still going to wear it. Um, and then the shorts, they're very big, like right here and like around, but they fit up here. So, I'm, I'm, and they're really big over here too. So, I'm going to give these shorts like a 5, because they are big, even though they shouldn't be, because the size chart. So, yeah, I'll probably only wear these shorts if like I'm going nowhere and no one can see me. Because I don't really like them. But, yeah. Alright, so now we have top Shein, bottom Shein. Um, I'm going to give the top a 10 out of 10 because it fits how it's supposed to. I'll do a little turn on so you guys can see the back. Because it does have like a whole thing going on back there. Um, whoa, my hair. 
um it's not a cheap material it's like you would think that it's like this really thin thing it's really not it's kind of thick um this is great for like going to a party or something uh and the dean i'm also getting a 10 out of 10 they fit perfectly and yeah they're of course a little scrunchy Ooh, i can't even pick up my legs hold on there you go they're of course a little scrunchy on the bottom but that's about it they are stretchy and yeah both 10 out of 10 10 out of 10 all right so now we have bottom Shein, top Shein. Um, top rating is 10 out of 10. There's literally nothing wrong with this top. It's cotton, it's nice and cute, the little spin. It's nice and cute. Um, yeah, 10 out of 10 for the top. The bottom, I don't like. Um, it's very big in this area. I don't know why, it's like literally huge. Um, they fit like lengthwise, but I don't like the pants like at all. So, and they're kind of big on the top a little bit. Um, so I'm giving the pants a 2 out of 10. Um, they would have been cuter if this wasn't so big. So, yeah, because they fit on my hips. They fit on my hips perfectly fine. The length is good. It's just this whole section. So, and it, like, ruins the whole pair of jeans. So, 2 out of 10, 10 out of 10. Now we have this top and this bottom, both from Shein. The bottom I'm giving a 10 out of 10. It's literally so nice. It's not see-through or anything. Definitely worth the price because it was very cheap. Um, and it fits like everywhere. Um, so 10 out of 10, it is a little thin, but that's perfectly fine with me because it is for summer. So like, what does it matter? Um, the top I'm gonna give a 9 out of 10 because I love it, but it is a little see-through um, over here. So that was obviously expected because it is like a tank top. So, um, but yeah, I'm giving it a 10 out of 10. And then for the next one, I'm keeping the skirt on, just a different white top, because I got two white tops for this one skirt. All right, so this top, I'm gonna give an eight out of 10, because for the same reason, one, it's a little see-through here, but two, this is size small and it's kind of big, and I wasn't expecting it to be big. So I thought it's gonna be like a little more fitted, especially like up here. So, yeah, I probably won't wear this top with this skirt because I don't really like it. I like other top better with the skirt, but I'll definitely be wearing this top with, like, shorts or anything. So, yeah, 8 out of 10 for the top. Um, so, this top is from Fashion Nova. Sweats are from Shein. I'm um, giving the sweats a 10 out of 10 because they fit me like sweatpants. They're big and very comfy. The material isn't itchy. Let me do a turn. The material isn't itchy or anything. Top is from Fashion Nova. Um, I'm gonna give it also a 10 out of 10. I'm just gonna have to wear an actual bra with that, but that's okay because I you can't won't be able to see the bra. So that's fine. So yeah, 10 out of 10 and 10 out of 10. So now we have some sweat shorts and a crop top, tube top, whoa, from both from Shein. Tube top, 10 out of 10, nothing's wrong with it, perfectly fine. Um, the pants. I'm going to give, because of my height restrictions, because I'm 4'11", like I said, they are long. I'm going to cut them up to, like, here. But I'm not going to, like, let that affect my grading because they do fit everywhere else and they're very comfy and the material is nice and thin. So 10 out of 10 for both. I'm just going to have to cut the pants a little more so that they fit me like sweatshorts and not like the pants that were just cut at the knees. So, yeah, both I'm giving a 10 out of 10. Alright, so she and she in the bottom giving a 10 out of 10, they're sweatpants and they're very cute. Um, they are cotton and they have buckets and they're really cute and they fit really well. Um, top I'm giving a 9 out of 10 because it's perfect. The only thing is that it is a little see-through over here, um, but and you kind of like can't wear a bra because of how this op how open this is. So um, yeah, I'll give this a 9 out of 10, but the fit is very cute. And yeah, um, I forgot to mention in the last one that the sweatpants are the last pair of pants. Besides for a couple more jeans from Fashion Nova that I'm going to show in the pictures in the end. So I'm going to keep the sweatpants on for the rest of the tops that I have. Um, but yeah, for this top, I'm going to give it an 8 out of 10 because it is super cute. And like, I love like the arms or whatever, but it is very thin. And I feel like if I'm outside, if like the wind comes, it's going to just like... I'm like go somewhere so I'm gonna give it an 8 out of 10 it is super cute I literally love it if, if only it was like a little thicker material so it wasn't like, like a little paper um it would be better but besides that I'd say it's perfect the fit is perfect so yeah all right so for this one I'm gonna be reading this top and this top because I can't get this on 
So, the top that I have on, I'm rating a 10 out of 10. Super cute, very simple, nice and thin, um, rigid, it's perfect, really cute. Um, and then this top, I cannot get on because the material is not stretchy enough. Like, it really doesn't stretch at all. And like this way stretches a very little bit but it doesn't stretch at all and it's very hard to get over your shoulders so i can get here because clearly it my, it may fit who knows at this point but this one i'm giving a zero because you can't get it on so i can't rate it and obviously i went everything by the size chart so this should be fitting me but it doesn't i even loosened like the back strings and everything i didn't take them out because that would have been a lot of work and if it's that much work to take on and put off take on and put put on and take off a shirt that's like too much work for me um so yeah this one giving a zero it was it was cute while it lasted because it has like a back like that see i don't know if you see i don't really know but it was cute while it lasted um and then this one i'm giving a 10 all right so this top i'm giving a 10 out of 10 do a whole turn so you guys can see the back um it is super cute it is not tight it fits perfectly um it's not itchy it's good material Super cute with like a pair of like maybe black shorts or like black jeans. Super cute. Um, so yeah, 10 out of 10. Alright, so now I'm going to rate this top and the sweater. On um, the top I'm giving a 9 out of 10 because it is a little big in the front right here. But besides that, it's perfect. It's very comfy, you know. 9 out of 10. The sweater, I'm giving a 10 out of 10. It is very loose, very thin, nice for a summer day. Let's say you're going to like a restaurant or something and need a little sweater. Um, so yeah, the shirt gets a 9 out of 10, the sweater gets a 10 out of 10. It's a very cute color, it's like a powder blue. Alright, so this is the first dress. I'm going to be giving this dress a 8 out of 10 because it is very cute. And you know, it, mm, whoa, it was exactly what I expected except for the fact that the material is like what you wear. Like, you know like your swim shorts that you wear to the the pool like that's the material of this dress and i don't know if it's gonna like make me sweat a lot when i'm outside so that's why i'm giving the dress an 8 out of 10 because besides that the fit is good the sizing was good um everything else was perfect all right so this is the next dress i'm rating this dress a 10 out of 10 there's nothing wrong with it it is exactly how it was supposed to fit um it's not see-through or anything it is a nice and thin material for the summer so yeah, this dress is getting a 10 out of 10. Alright guys, so this is the romper. Um, I have one more dress, but it is going to be in a picture in the end because I already wore it. So this romper, I'm going to give a, 10, oh, a 9 out of 10 because as I was putting it on, there's like this belt right here, right? And they're belt hoops, but it's very, it's literally like a little, I don't know if you guys can see it or not, it's like literally little tiny um little piece of like material and it um snapped on the side literally as i was putting it on so that's why i'm giving it a 9 out of 10 not a 10 out of 10 because besides that it is um perfect there's a little button here that i need to like clasp there you go so like besides that little inconvenience right there it's perfect it's very cute nice thin material for the summer and the fit as well all right so this is the last romper uh, I'm giving this like a 7 out of 10. I don't really like the way it looks on me. Cause, but the fit is fine. Like the fit, it fits up here. Um, it fits everywhere else. I just don't personally like the way it looks on me. Because the shorts part looks really long. Um, because like I've said like a thousand times, I'm really short. So I'm giving this like, what did I say? I think it's like an 8, but I'm going to lower it to like a 6. Because I only wear this if like I'm going to the pool. and like like a cover up kind of. So yeah, this is getting like a 6 out of 10. The color's cute though, and the design is cute. I just don't like the way it fits on me. Alright, so now moving on to the bathing suits. Um, this one is a little small, and it's very hard to like tie in the back. So this one, I'll definitely like still wear it because it is cute and it still like fits. But I'm gonna have to give this one like a 7 because of the sizing. It is kind of small. So yeah, but it's really cute. Um, it's a cute color, and yeah. Alright, so here's the next one. Um, I'm gonna give this one a, like, 6, because I don't like how long these strings are on the side. Um, it is a little big over here, and up here, I feel like it's gonna fall because of, like, here, let's fix that. 
I feel like it's gonna fall because of the strings on the side. I feel like it's pulling it down, but then if it's not as tight as I have it right now, I tried and it was falling because it was too big. So I'm giving this one a six out of 10. All right, so now we have this one. Um, I'm rating this one a 10 out of 10. The color is super cute and it fits perfectly. I didn't tie it in the back because like, didn't really need to. If I tie it in the back, it'll just get tighter, which I'm fine with. Um, it is perfect material. Um, so yeah, this one's getting a 10 out of 10. Nothing's wrong with it, anything. All right, so this I'm gonna rate like separately. They came together and they're one bathing suit, but I'm gonna rate them separately because of the fit of them, as you guys can see right here. So the bottom giving a 10 out of 10 fits perfect. It's so cute. It's like very thick right here, which is good. The top, I'm gonna have to give like a five because it is very big. Like on the the top fits not the top, but the top of the top fits perfectly, but then the bottom of the top is very loose all around. So I don't know if I'll be able to wear this. And it also has a very thick padding, which I wasn't expecting. So yeah, the bottom the top is gonna get a five, the bottom is gonna get a ten. Alright, so now we have this bathing suit. This so far is my favorite. I literally love it. The fit is amazing. Um, material, swim material, obviously. It's not tight or anything. It fits everywhere. So this one I'm definitely going to give like 100 out of 10. Like it's literally my favorite. The color and everything. I'll do like a whole spin. So yeah, this one's definitely getting a 100 out of 10. Love it completely. Alright, so this one I'm also giving, well not also, this one is 100 out of 10. This one is going to be 10 out of 10. Um, it is perfect, there's nothing wrong with it. It fits everywhere, not big or small. Um, yeah, it does have, since you guys know, it does have padding. Why is the padding all the way over there? Okay, well, it does have padding, and it fits perfectly. I don't know, there you go. I moved it down a little bit, you can see the difference. Um, this is just like a string that it has attached to it, and you just tie it right there, and it's really cute. So yeah, 10 out of 10. Alright, so now we have this one. Um, this one is getting a 10 out of 10. There's nothing wrong with it. It's perfectly fine. Um, it's really cute. I love like the tie-dye in the blue. Um, the top is like a little, a very tiny bit big right there, but like it's nothing that you can see and it doesn't affect like the like the support or whatever. So yeah, this is definitely getting a 10 out of 10. Alright, so this one and the next one are both three-piece bathing suits. Um, it comes with the top the bottom and then the shorts so at first I was gonna give this a 10 out of 10 but then the top is a tad big on the under part right there I can like cover it with the string because this this like comes in like one piece and it's just like sprung out like this gets down this gets down just like one long piece so you can like adjust it as needed so that's why I'm gonna give it a 9 out of 5 because it is a little big over here but for besides that, everything else of this three-piece set fits perfectly. So we're going to do 9.5 because it's three pieces, only one is a little messed up. So we're going to do three, uh, whoa, why did I say 3.5? 9.5 out of 10. All right, so this is my last bathing suit. It is a three-piece set. It has this set, the bottom, and then the top. Um, I'm giving this a 100 out of 10. Literally love it. It fits everywhere. Um, like, the fit is perfect. The color is perfect. Um, I wouldn't want it any other way. I'm probably going to order this one in, like, the pink and the blue as well because it's so cute. Um, so, yeah. Now, I'm just going to do my jewelry. I guess I can just, like, do it now because, like, I have no more clothes to try on for you guys. Um, the rest of the clothes will be the pictures at the end. So, let me just grab the doll. Here we have the ne this necklace. Let me see. There you go. We have this necklace. Um, let me try to fix it a little bit because it is a little messy. You know what? We're not gonna try to fix it. Um, because of how tangled this necklace came, I haven't tried it on or anything. I'm not gonna try any of the jewelry on because that's like just like a waste of time, honestly. I'm basing it off of like how it looks or whatever. So based on how this came, I'm gonna have to detangle this. So I'm gonna give it like a six because it is very very tangled and it came like this. So this is gonna get a six. Um, now we have another necklace. I'm assuming that's what this is. So now we have this necklace. Oh, this is very cute. This is what it looks like. It has like lightning bolts. I honestly don't remember half the stuff I bought. So this is very cute. Like let's just do it like that. Oh my god, so cute. Ten out of ten. Um, because nothing's wrong with it. Oh, this is the one that I bought. This is Baby Girl, I think. Let's make sure before I start chatting. Yeah. Wait, does it say Baby Girl? Yeah, it has Baby Girl on it. It's like right there. Super cute. 
Woohoo. 10 out of 10. Um, now let's do silver pair and a gold pair. I'm going to have to give that 10 out of 10, both of them. So overall, I feel like the jewelry was good, besides for like that one, which I have to detangle, because I'm pretty sure after I detangle it, it'll be fine. Um, so hopefully I don't break it in the process of detangling it. So, yeah. If you guys have any other like items or any like stores that you want me to do try-on hauls for, just let me know, comment down below, and I'll definitely do it. Um, so yeah, if you like this video, oh wait, not yet. I'm going to do the pictures and stuff. Then we're going to come back. Okay, so now we are completely done. And like I said, comment down below if you have any suggestions on stores or clothing items, anything like that. Um, so yeah, if you like this video, don't forget to subscribe, like, and turn on the bell so you get notified whenever I post.